Hey, it's Sam from Dan Talk Real Talk. So let's talk. I want to talk about fantasies. And I'm telling you that today um, I was driving home from work. I was looking around and seeing, you know, how beautiful it was, sunny and bright and so nice. And then I started fantasizing about, you know, uh, I'm with someone and this and that. And I played it all out in my head. And I don't mind telling you, I was really worked up, like really, really, really worked up. Or really horny if you want to just put it in those terms and <clears throat> it made me think about how the power of the mind the power of the brain i've always said that sex is a mind fuck a brain fuck but really and truly today and it's not the first time it's happened but today is the first time it's happened in a long time to the degree it was like volcanic sex it was like earthquake sex in my brain <clears throat> i could hardly wait to get home and resolve my issue, if you know what I mean, right? It was amazing to me. And it just lets me know that everyone should have that kind of, to me, that's the, the type of thing that you need to work on. You need to figure out, you need to explore more often, and then you need to take it to the next level with the person you're with. Your partner, whatever it is, it, it, it's such a fantastic um, expression and it's such a fantastic outlet. You're talking full on in your head, fantasy sex. What you would do, you're touching his cock, you're feeling his balls, he's kissing you. He's standing in front of you and saying, tell me no if you don't want me to do it. And it's sexy and it's seductive and it really turns you on. And those kinds of fantasies and those kinds of encounters, even with yourself, can make your sex life go from one to a hundred, just like that. It was a gift for me today that I haven't given myself in a long time. So I guess the point of this is give yourself the gift of letting you turn you on and get you off. This is Diane from Diane Talk, Real Talk, Wheel Talk. And <laughs> tomorrow we'll talk about something else, but I'm telling you, I'm pretty zen right now. Bye.